Hey, what's up, guys? Um, so as I just saw again, I was thinking, you know what? Why don't I next go see, um, in the aberration cave where I was taming the stuff from last episode? That Megapithecus tribute is in there, and since that seems to be the only one I've been, you know, I found so far in my travels, um, I figured that that's what I should work towards next. Um, is uh, we're getting the stuff to run that Megapithecus um boss fight so uh i'm gonna hop on the mana i'm gonna go over to that cave and i'm gonna take a look and see what it is that i actually need to gather to run that so uh i'm gonna hop on the mana here and uh i'll see you guys over there all right so we're almost over here um gotta eliminate a few of these ravengers here there's a ton of them in here this time all right so now I think I can freely get over to here. Um, so let's see, what do we need to run this? Let's see. So, so to run Gamma, we need the Brute, the Devourer, and the Pack. And what is that, Steinborn Relic? We need the Steinborn Relic? I don't even know what that is. Huh. Yeah, and we do need uh, tributes, dino tributes to run these ones, to run Gamma and Alpha. Hey, at least Alpha's minimal survival requirement is only 85 for that. Okay, well, what was that? Okay, that was just my mana eating. So, you know, I think I'm going to pack Devour and Brew. Well, I guess that's what I got to start working for is then. And that relic. Okay, well. Uh, so I I'm going to look up where that artifact of the pack cave is, and then uh, I'll meet you guys over there. All right. Here we are, guys. Uh, <laughs> I'm nervous as hell. I ain't going to lie. Uh, the one thing I will say, though, is uh, if this cave is super tough, like, I, I'm not going to keep trying to go in there. It takes way too long to raise tanks. Uh, I'm going to run it. And if I get out of there with the artifacts, cool. But if not, like, you know, one of the nice things about being on, uh, on the clusters, I can go to another map where it's easier to get the artifact. Uh, but I am going to... Um, I'm going to try every, every cave, though. Um, and this being our first one... Um, yeah, I'm going to give this a try. Um, I'm hoping that the Dismodus can fly in here. And I'm also hoping that I can... And I'm hoping that the Thal will be okay in here. Um, if I die, this is going to suck. I just want to be able to go slow. I wish I was a little bit more... I can use stuff off the back of him. That's good to know. I'm super scared. I ain't gonna lie. Like... Oh, I didn't mean to latch. Like, bruh. All right, see, this sucks. I wanted to be able to have like a clean landing pad, you know what I'm saying? So now I gotta literally go back to the beginning and my nerves are already wrecked doing this. Like can the, does Modus even deal with those? I don't know, can he deal with the? With the bats, I guess we're gonna find out. Wow, it's a 190, are you kidding me? I mean... I get that I'm hot. Oh, 
Oh, you know what? I am gonna go out real quick. I'm gonna end up falling in that lava and dying. I need to fill up this canteen so I can deal with the heat. I switched it to cold but forgot to get water. Yeah, this is, you know... I'll bring you guys back when I'm ready to <laughs> tempt this for real. Okay, here we go. I want to go slow. Seems like this mode is even and slow mode is pretty fast. I want him to land on the ground, but he wants to land on the ceiling. That's just not helping me out at all, you know? So that's what I wanted to do. Put you out. Make sure these guys are on passive. Crap. Oh, I wanted to hold in there for the last second, but it wasn't worth it. Okay, so this is very reminiscent of the lava biome um, on the island, which is probably the one I've done the most, most, most familiar with. Oh, he's getting knocked around. I don't like that. I don't want him to follow me. I don't want him to fall down there and land in the lava. I guess rather he might as well be fighting than getting hit, right? Alright, I'm trying not to go too far. I got plenty of med brews. This might end up being a long video, so I apologize for that. Yo, is it server saving? Why can't I hit these back? I mean... I think he's still on passive, because I have him... I forgot to set him to listen to group whistles. Careful, I'm gonna die. There we go. Oh, we killed my. Oh, I thought that was my Desmodus that just died. I was like, already? Oh, I mean, this is annoying. How many of these Onyx are in here? Like I told you, I didn't tell you guys I was ready. Why are you gonna attack now? He is looking. Is that just his color or is he looking bloody? I can't really tell. No. Just wanna slow walk. Yeah, attack me. There we go. Cool. Can I get you to... Come low enough so I can like... Now what's it doing? Server saving? It's gonna get me killed. I did bring a tech suit. Oh, I am wearing a, one of those free tech suits from Gen 2 so I can have... The tech suit do the whole thing. Oh, we got walloped. We got wa I absolutely walloped. Um, so yeah, I have the tech suit. So that way he can, um... So that way I, you know, the Arthur Plural, I know they like to damage your armor. So I brought that so I can take... 
So if I take damage, my, my suit won't break. Alright, um... Why has everything got to be so high level up in here? This is very much like in the in the in the heart of the artifact of the massive on the island. That's I'm getting those exact vibes from here. But the one thing I will say is it's, it is does feel a lot more enemy dense. Um, definitely want these. Way more enemy dense. Which I guess is for people like me who have, you know, mutated stuff. Make it a little more challenging for us. I like this so nice and wide open. So I gotta remember, I'm going towards that lava stream over there. On the way out. Don't want to get caught going that way. I did. I do know where the artifact is, where both of them are in here. Matter of fact, so I got to make sure I don't get caught going that way, and I go this way. No rune stone so far. Haven't got rabies yet, if I haven't mentioned that already. But I brought the med bruise just in case. Like I said, I'm soul walking this because I do not want to fall in that lava. I don't know if that lava is insta-death or if it's like the simulation lava where you can, you know, it only takes like three hit points a tick. And I definitely do not want to find out, you know. Um, okay, we're looking good so far. There it is. Oh, sweet. I ain't gonna lie though, my heart is pounding, man, for real. Like, this is making me nervous. Alright, so wait. Okay, this looks like a clear path over to it. Araneo on its way over here. Or Arneo, however you want to pronounce that. behind me. Am I not hitting them? There we go. Arca plural. Yeah, those things will absolutely wreck your armor. As you guys probably already know. I mean, yeah, it's very enemy dense in here. Surprisingly, though, I haven't come across any any rune stones in here yet. Wow, artifact of the pack. That's so much easier on the island than in here. Okay, so we're gonna go back the way we came. I'm definitely not feeling adventurous for my first first trip in here. Um. Yeah, this way feels right, and then I know it kind of wants to pull you to the left. That I want to avoid, and I want to hit the right over here. We will eventually probably explore back there when I'm feeling in a... I think that's a loop. Looks like a roundabout, maybe. Raise up a throwaway thalo, so that way if I lose it, it's not a big deal. Okay. 
Whoa. Okay. Always gotta bite. Always bite. If you're unofficial, man, bite before you jump. Make sure you're not lagging, you know? Make sure it's not server saving on you. Alright, so we got some much needed tito titanoboa venom. Definitely need that. RNAOs here. Oops. Definitely don't need to fast run through here. I'm actually going to slow walk and jump. Alright, it's not server saving. So that's good. Well... This has got to be like the Titan Cave of the map so far. From what I've gathered so far. Whoa. It took me out of my slow walk mode. Maybe because I pushed on the button. Probably. pretty good too. I'm surprised that I'm not overheating. I'm hot, but I'm not overheating, luckily. See something over there, is that it? That looks like it from way over here. So close but so far away. And the nice thing too is like <laughs> you could teleport in this. So I am going to You can tell I'm gonna teleport out of here. <laughs> I am not trying to make my way back through here unnecessarily. Um, here we go. Are they coming for me? I wanna... I don't wanna be fighting those over them, over this narrow path, because they haven't really been pushing me around too much, but... Oh, it's only a 40. I haven't even been really paying, it, paying attention to the levels. And I've been so, like, laser-focused on just trying not to make a mistake in here. But the levels don't even seem that bad in here. Well, there we go. Those, okay, I spoke too soon. So I guess there's a mixture of... some good, you know, low levels and some high levels. Okay, how many are left? Is it serve saving? No. Why are you flying up there? Okay, so how are we looking? I see, what, two more? It looks like. Three more? Oh, look at where they got them drops. And they got them in such a tempting place. If it wasn't for lag, I would take a chance and go get those. But the problem is when you're server saving, sometimes it just drops you out of the sky, you know, and, and you still take the damage, you know. And then it'll put you back where you were, but the problem is that, you know, if you hit that lava, you'll die. So it's like... It's too, uh, uh, just a little too risky for me. You know, this is obviously a highly busy server. Look at all the people that are on. So when you're, uh, you know, when you got this many people on, 
you know, that definitely is gonna, you know, add to the, the to the latency of the server. Oh, I'm so tempted because I wonder if the stuff, how good the stuff is in here. Okay, we are here. My experience too is that the drops are never worth it in the caves, man. Once in a while you might get something good, but... Come on, this is stupid. Like, he's just... just above my Thalos hitbox, or hit range. Do I risk it for the biscuit over there? Sleeping bags. Make sure you're on passive. Let's risk it for the biscuit, right? Let's do it. Let's see what we get. Let's see if... Oh my goodness, that is trash. Oh, a runestone. I'm glad I did that because I did not see this one. It was hiding. So I think I got a long neck blueprint, but I don't think it's that much better than what I've already got. I did, 176, and I'm using a 188, I think. I don't know, I didn't bring that stuff with me, trike saddle, my goodness. Yeah, that was definitely not worth it. All right, let's grab this. Yeah, I've learned that a lot of the times the, the caves, I don't know what the loot table's like for this map. I don't know how worth it is or not, but. But yeah, there it is. We just got the artifact of the clever. Good stuff, man. That's what's up. Um, I'm so tempted to go back, but I, I, I'm not going to. I don't think it's worth it. I got the artifacts. I can teleport out of here. Like, I think that's what I'm going to do. Let's see. Why risk it? You know what I'm saying? Um... I think this will work. I'm going to cryo the thalo just because you just never know. Yeah, that's what's up, man. I was definitely nervous going through that, you know? Like, I'm like, what if something goes... Like I always say in the videos, man, what if something goes wrong, you know? It's always the things you can't predict, man. But that was sweet. All right, so that's two artifacts down. Um, I know we needed the uh, pack for the... Uh, for the Megapithecus, but I might as well get the, um... I figure I might as well grab the Clever while I'm in there, since it said it was in there, you know? Alright, so did this put me... I'm trying to get close to... Okay, so I'm, like, kind of close, but I'm not. Okay. Let's see... So yeah, oh wow, that was, I'm not going to lie, that was fun now that I got through it. Um, if that was an easy enough cave, I would have definitely gone all the way back through, but, um, you know, <laughs> I'm just happy that I got through it, you know. Um, so that's pretty straightforward, man. Um, I don't know what flyers you could bring in there. I don't think you could bring any flyers. Uh, normally on story maps, you can't bring flyers, and I know this isn't a story map, but I think they're treating it like that where, you know, you, they made it so there's, you know, no flyers allowed. So I think maybe cinema crops if you had one, or you know you can use the desmodus. So I'm going the complete wrong way. Use the desmodus, and then yeah, I would just do the thalo, since it seems to still be one of the most easily controlled tame in my opinion for you know cave running. Um, yeah, and we got it done. So that's what's up, man. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna set this up on a pedestal uh, when I get to the base. So uh, I'll see you guys when I get there. Oh yeah, so I just parked the Desmodus, um, and we're going to go make an artifact pedestal to set that, put those uh, artifacts on. Um, I think, I might not be able to, I might have to go run and get some obsidian, I think about it because I got poly, but I don't think I have any obsidian in here, do I? Since I've been making it all in poly, and as I'm sitting here thinking, why do I need to... 
keep obsidian laying around and now I know because or pile yeah obsidian sitting around now I can't make the artifact pedal still so okay I'm gonna go get some obsidian real quick and then uh, we'll put those up on the um, artifact pedestal so uh, bring you guys back again in a second all right guys we're back um, <laughs> hopefully I got enough here oh, let me fill up this canteen <sighs> hopefully I got enough here to uh... how much should I get okay that's enough that's enough to make two pedestals I think we only need what's it 80 for each pedestal we only need to make two pedestals right now If I'm not mistaken, let's see, I think it's, since it's under miscellaneous, no, it must be under structures miscellaneous. Oh yeah, there it is, it was over there. Structures, miscellaneous. Sweet. Alright, let's see, we need our trusty ladder, I don't think I have one up there. Currently, that's facing the right way. I may, I may or may not. I'm not sure, but all right. I can remember how I did this on Gen 1. If I end up picking these up and removing them. I can't see neither because of the damn glare from the sun. Oh, it's right. Yep, that's what I thought. Oh, no, wrong way. Man, I swear that was right, too. Man, it's giving me a hard time. I know that's it. Come on. There we go. Then usually what I, if I remember correctly, what I did was I used this little point. Did I use a square? Yeah, like this. I think to center it. Yeah. Same thing with that one. Yep, okay. There we go. So there's the clever. And. Oh, okay. The other artifact pedestal right here. And then this one goes right here. Close enough. And the pack. Hell yeah. There it is. Our first two artifacts. I'm pumped, man. That could have went so bad, but man, that that was nerve-wracking, but it's done. So yeah, that's what's up. All right, so we got one down. We got two more to go before we can do that. Um, the uh, Megapithecus. Uh, we're gonna do it on Gamma first, and then obviously we'll do it on Beta and then uh, Alpha as needed. But um, but yeah, it's a good start. You know, our our first step towards doing the doing the boss. So. Um, yeah, that's a good way to end the episode. Uh, yeah, so we're going to end it here. Um, thanks guys for watching. Um, I'll see you guys in the next one.